As the G-Series meter housing is cut away in this animation, we see a cantilever type design where the multi-bladed rotor is supported by an upstream stator. The stator also channels the flow stream, depicted by the flowing blue arrows, through the rotor. The rotor is hydraulically balanced and floats on a virtually frictionless, highly polished tungsten carbide bearing. The rotational speed of the rotor is directly proportional to the axial flow velocity of the fluid. The rotor has a number of equally spaced blades that are made up of a paramagnetic material. A pickup coil is located directly above the rotor and is completely isolated from the fluid. It is constructed of many coils of fine wire that are wound around a permanent magnet. As each blade passes underneath the pickup coil, it passes through the magnetic field. The continual passing of the paramagnetic blades under the coil induces an AC voltage in the coil which is seen as a sinusoidal wave. The sinusoidal wave is then converted by the preamplifier into a square wave pulse stream, as shown. Since the flow area is constant and the rotor velocity is directly proportional to the flow velocity, each output pulse represents a precise amount of fluid that has passed through the meter. The continuous pulse stream is then transmitted to an electronic counter or flow computer to indicate both instantaneous flow rate and total metered volume.